Hey everyone, I'm back with a haul. I'm sorry I haven't done a lot of talk through makeup tutorials, but it's been really difficult to do that with a baby around because he's unpredictable. I usually do my tutorials in my videos when he's sleeping, but sometimes he wakes up throughout them, so I can't really do a talk through with a baby like talking, well not talking, but like babbling in the background or sometimes he's whining or crying. So I'm sorry about that, but today <laughs> I have a haul and I hope you guys enjoy the things that I bought as much as I do. Um, but yeah, now I'm going to get started. I'm going to start with things that I've bought from um, Forever 21. There's like a huge pile in front of me, which is like ridiculous. So uh, I'm sorry if some of the stuff is wrinkled or whatever. But um, I had it for a few days and I didn't want to put them away before showing you guys. So here it is. This is an ombre lace short from Forever 21. I thought this was really unique because usually you see them in this cream color or just black, but usually cream. And I thought that the ombre was different and I didn't really like just the cream. I don't know. I'm just more of like a dark girl. So I, yeah, I really enjoyed this one. Um, the next thing I got from them were these drawstring pants. These are very in this this season. Yeah, see that? That's mad wrinkled. Sorry. But anyway, the drawstring pants are very in this season. And I thought that the play on the jean material, which it really doesn't feel like jean, but it looks like jean, was very cute. So I thought that I could pair this up with like tanks or maybe like a shirt like this. Not this one though, but um, like a shirt like a sheer shirt like this in the summertime. It would look really cute. Uh, let's see, what else did I get? I got this other pair of drawstring pants and this has like a really cute pattern. Blue, I usually don't wear much patterned pants but you know I thought I'd change it up because my style is getting a little boring. Uh, I also got this high-low skirt with a um, like a mm, I would say like a taupe and black stripe print so it's also lined which the lining is uh, the taupe color and it's a high-low skirt. It's very sheer at the back, but it would look really nice in the summertime when the wind is blowing and you see the flowy material. Oh my god, I love that. I got these cool leggings because I practically live in leggings, so um, let's see. They're like this, and they have cheetah. You know, instead of cheetah print, it's actually like cheetah faces on it. Which is funny because um, the shirt that I'm wearing in the back has a cheetah. So, I thought that was cool. But yeah, <laughs> I would not wear it with this. This is cheetah overload. Um, but yeah, it's a really cool print. And the material is really soft. And I like how it's not black. It's more gray. And it's shiny. So, I really um, yeah, you might think I'm strange, but it's my style, man. I got this shirt from Forever 21 also, and it's just, like, beautiful. I love the print on it, and I love blue. I don't know. I'm getting more into the blueness. I'm not much of a blue person, but I'm trying to switch it up. So, um, I thought the print was lovely. It's very tropical. I don't know, the little palm trees, I don't know, but yeah, this with some like high-waisted pants, like one of those pants that I showed you, or like um, a high-waisted leather, leather skirt, which is probably how I'm going to wear it because I love the leather, but yeah, this would look awesome with any of that. Um, I got also this cute, really nice um maxi dress which in the picture 
uh, on the website. The lining is not as long as the entire dress, but um, it actually is, so I'm probably going to have to get it hemmed, and, you know, because I don't want it that long. I want, like, the, the inside lining to be shorter than the actual dress, but this is what the dress looks like, and I know it doesn't look like much on, like, like this, but, like, on, it looks so nice. I don't know. Cream top, which I thought would look nice over tanks. Or, you know, with like a bright colored bra or tank underneath, it would look really nice. And it's very summery with shorts. It would look awesome, I'm thinking. Yeah. So it looks like this. Whoa. Last thing I got from them is, um, no wait, I know there's something else. But maybe if I'll oh too much shit. Sorry. Oh yeah, yeah, I found, found it. Okay. Um the second to last thing I got is uh, this um I would say like a orange -y coral top, just basic, you know, just for a pop of color because I usually just wear black. On, I usually just wear black on the bottom half of me, so I thought that the color would really add something else to the outfit. So yeah. And um, I also got, this is the last thing I got from um, Forever 21. It's this olive colored um, leather paneled basic, which, you know, like I said before, I love leather, so anything with leather is going to be mine. Anything with leather is going to be mine. So, um, I had to get this. Yeah. I also picked up some things from ASOS, not too much, like three things. Um, I needed a pair of new um, leather pants and, um, I saw these on ASOS on sale, so I was like, cool, I'm going to get them. And they're like this. They're kind of like a crimping material, but it stretches out once it's on. And it comes with two back pockets, um, if you can see. And I know it doesn't look much like much um, like this because it is so wrinkly bought on it's beautiful because there's still some of the wrinkle left but it's not like this like this is too much wrinkle but um, yeah <laughs> like yeah um so i just realized that cream has been a recurring color in my choices for this purchases for these purchases so Sorry, but I really didn't realize that I was this much into cream until right now. Um, <laughs> uh, so the next thing I got from ASOS is this beautiful top, which is so hard to show, by the way, because it's like open in the shoulder area right here. So, and it's like high neck and then, okay. So, all right, can you see? So it has a really nice slit down the decolletage or the chest area right here by your bosoms and it is um, it has a really long slit in the back because this, this is the back view of it and uh, like I said before it has the shoulders open am I showing you this? I don't know but yeah I thought that this was awesome and this was also on sale but I don't remember how much it was um, yeah. Another cream item, which, yeah, is like, is this shirt. It's like a tuxedo, um, jacket kind of, but it's more, it's, it's a shirt instead of a blazer. And, um, I thought this was really cool because, oh, oh my god, with black pants, with black high-waisted pants, it would look, oh! 
amazing do you see that do you see how beautiful this is oh so I had to have it I don't really particularly like the material of this though it's not I mean it doesn't feel very expensive like I would have thought that it would feel more silky but it feels more like um, poly estery if that makes sense I don't know uh, but it's like a rougher material, but anyway, no one's going to be touching my shirt, so, yeah, just looking at it, it looks pretty expensive. Um, anywho, that is that from ASOS. I also got three pairs of shoes, uh, two from Ideally and then one from Zara. I'm going to show you the Ideally first because those have been hanging around for like two, three weeks, and I was waiting for all these other items to come in. So... Um, I also wore them, so they're kind of dirty. Please don't mind that. Sorry. And you won't be able to find these again, which I'm also sorry for, but I thought it would be cool to just let you guys see it because it is, um, they, I mean, they are nice, and they also have, like, a trend thing. So, yeah, I love these. These are my favorite one of the two that I bought. But the only thing is that they do stain quite a lot, um, I am not really sure how to remove the stain from these, but if anyone knows anything, please let me know. So this is by the brand Bamboo, and I got these shoes off of Ideally for a really good price, $20, and they are cap toe rose gold. Oh my gosh, very in trend for the spring and the summertime, so I was excited to get my hands on these. I was surprised that it wasn't very um, popular on the web, on the website, um, on the Ideally website, but... To me, these are beautiful because I've been searching for a pair like this and I didn't want to pay too much for them because I knew I would wear the shit out of them and then uh, I, all my money would be wasted. So yeah, 20 bucks. I do remember the price of these. 20 bucks! Um, next are these black ones which are alright, I guess. They're also capitaled but uh, and the other one, they were a metal material and these are um, more of a fabric material which I don't like because as you can see they get ruined quite easily um, but yeah these are cool and this is by the brand, the brand um, Restricted but yes I love them I love them anyway they're not my ideal cap toe black flats but if you know I find another one I'll probably get it but these were only 20 bucks so I can't really complain. And finally, from Zara, which I ordered online because um, I really don't like heading into the city to just go to one store. So, what else? And uh, I have a bridal shower coming up. My my friend's getting married, and she's having like a little bridal shower right, like a week before her her wedding. So. The dress code is black or white only, and I don't really have any shoes that would go with this beautiful dress that I bought off Forever 21, which is also coming, which is going to be on another haul. Uh, but uh, I got the shoes for it, and they look like this. LMG, tell me how beautiful you think these are, because I think they're so pretty. Anyway, yeah, I wanted the all white ones, but they were out of stock. Then I saw these and I was like, er, er, a J. I like these whole much better. And they are quite comfortable. I would say that the um, strap right here is a little um, tight if you have a wider foot, which I do have. Um, but since it is leather, I think that is it is going to stretch out. They're quite comfortable, but I haven't really walked far in these. Obviously, you know, the tags on it. Um, but, um, yeah. I love this. I love him. I love him. Someone. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anyway. Now that is over. I know. It was. Ugh. <sighs> so that is the stuff that I've accumulated in the past two, two, three weeks. Um. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. And I hope you've had some inspiration and in what to maybe get for this summer. And, you know, Forever 21 is really affordable and it is coming out with a lot of, um, 
expensive looking but still reasonably priced stuff so you guys have to really check in with Forever, Tw Forever 21 online and in the stores but for the most part I think that they are doing a great job with with um, their new clothes so yes um anyway I think the baby just woke up so that's why I stopped anyway hope you guys really enjoyed the haul and I'll see you guys soon